Hello guys, it's Adolf here. Welcome to Adolf Codes. So, in my previous video, I did an introduction to my channel and I did make mention that my tutorials are going to be project-based focused. So in this video, I'm going to introduce to you um, a project that you'll be working on, which is a 10x10 navigation system with uh, Google Maps, let's say Google Maps clone. But we are going to build that from scratch in Flutter. So without further ado, let's get into it. So first of all, we have um, Google Maps and um, Flutter Google Maps implemented in um, in our app, and we have also the place search above here. So Google Place autocomplete search here. We can actually um, search for uh, a place, and we can navigate to. Aside that, you also see we have like our custom widgets, like a button here. Once you click on it, it actually uh, uh, moves the camera to our current position. Then, once the user search or we search for a location, we can see um, su some suggestions below. Then we can select the location that we want to go to. And when we do so, we are also able to see a route from our current location to the destination. And then we are able to see the time and the distance that will take us to get to that destination. Then when you click on this start button, we can navigate to that destination. And of course, once we are navigating, we have to like get some direction. So here we can see our uh, uh, 10 by 10 direction, which is instructions given to us when we are going to the, uh, we are moving towards our destination. And also when, for instance, the driver or we deviate our route, okay, or mistakenly deviate our route, or we move to a different uh, um, direction, our uh, application is also able to like detect that and reroute us to our destination. Then we can just follow the route. And once we get to our destination, the status of the direction just changed to if arrived, just telling us that, yeah, we got to our destination. So, and let's, um, okay, so let's see what um, this we are going to cover in this build. Some of the packages, plugins, the things that we need to know, all the things that we are going to cover in order for us to build this. So, things to cover. We are going to cover Flutter basis. Of course, we have to like get um, some fundamentals in Flutter before we can even build this. And we are going to cover state management in Flutter um, with GetX. Um, I chose GetX because it's very simple. Um, it's so clean and very easier for um, us to use and to build this and um, project faster. We're also going to cover the geolocation API to get a current um, coordinate or the current position of our phone. And then we're also going to cover the Google Maps API. Google Maps API, we're going to cover the Flutter Google Maps. Um, also, here yeah, we're going to um, see how we can animate our markers on the map and also animate our uh, camera to also follow us um, in the uh, on the app and the directions api this is actually going to help us to um, route between one destination one, one one coordinate to the other and also get our 10 by 10 instructions to our destination the distance matrix api is going to help us to get the time taken and the distance and uh, between two or more uh, um, coordinates or the time and the distance that we've covered so far or the time that will take us to get to our destination the place search if api of course before we can um, actually route or move, navigate to our destination we have to like search the place so the google place search api is going to allow us to actually search for our location then we can navigate to and last but not the least uh, we're going to cover google maps utilities and this is actually going to help us um, determine whether we are on the right um, route to our destination and also other functionalities like get a distance between two or more coordinates and more yeah so this is what the build is going to cover and if you're excited about this build don't forget to click on the like button so others can also see this video and can join us and don't forget to subscribe to this channel of course <laughs> i need it and don't forget to click on the notification bell so anytime i post new tutorials of course after this i'm going to post um the tutorials um which are which are going to be in uh, i think about eight um videos that i'm going to post so yeah don't forget to click on the bell button so once i do so you'll be the first person to actually um, watch those videos and follow and i hope you just um, follow this tutorial very well and 
build an awesome project that you see out there and there are more and more and more projects which are actually coming so stay tuned thank you so much bye bye